So free space. That no. <laughs> that And now for our feature presentation. My tenth game. Welcome to my tenth game of Who Wants to Be a Millionaire Kids Edition for the PC, in which so far I've won myself three million five hundred ninety-eight thousand dollars in nine games, and I'm hoping to win another million. As this time we have Connor Mayrose joining in. Hi everyone. Hello. Let's go tackle that million. Who wants to be a millionaire? Kids Edition. know what to call you. Oh, thanks. Breezy Obs. Are we ready to go? Yeah. Here we go. Who wants to be a Millionaire Kids Edition? Game 10. Alright, here it is. Your very first question. First oh, question wow. is worth $100. Wow. Here we go. $100 question. What kind of food is jerky? Dried meat? Bean soup? Trail mix? Tater tots? Having eaten this kind of food before, jerky is dried meat. A. So, you're cool with answer A. Fine. Yep. Hey, you're Good right. Good old beef jerky worth $100. Okay, you waste the first one, but they're gonna get much tougher now. Let's see what's in store for you for your $200 question. Here we go for $200. According to the song of the, according to the words of the song, John Jacob Jingleheimer Schmidt, his name is what? Really long, my name too, the coolest ever, easy to make fun of. Well, the answers A and D are accurate, but I'm gonna go with my name too, B. You're ready to roll with answer B. Fine. His name is my name too, wicked. and I got it right, $200. Hey, two questions, two hundred dollars. It's bound to be more than your allowance. And all you have to do to get another hundred is answer the next question correctly. Regis, I don't even get an allowance anymore. I work for my money. For three hundred dollars. Oh, that's true. The character Humpty Dumpty is usually drawn in the shape of what breakfast food? Donut? Pan egg? Pancake? Nutri-grain twists. He's an egg. B. Going with answer B for sure. Okay. Yes. Nice job, kid. You're right. And I just won $300. <laughs> That's 300 bucks and a chance at 500. Let's roll. Here we go for $500. In 2000, Hershey's, Hershey's introduced a new syrup bottle in the shape of what animal? Bunny, bear, cow, moose. <laughs> I'm going to say C, cow. You're thinking answer C is pretty sweet, eh? Yeah. You all. Yeah, buddy! $500. Get the next question right, and I've got a thousand guaranteed and an eleventh game. Doing a fat job here. Let's keep it going and take a look at your one thousand dollar question. Here we go for one thousand dollars. I'll bring it back real quick. Go ahead. Yep. Where are the knuckles located on the body? Scalp, lips, throat. Fingers. They're in your fingers, D. Hey, answer D looks pretty fly to you, doesn't it? Yep. <laughs> nice. Guaranteed an 11th game. One thousand.
thousand dollars in the bank. You've got just ten questions left until we add a lot more zeros to that number. Here we go for two thousand dollars. What musical group released the two thousand album Black and Blue? Destiny's Child, Boys to Men, Spice Girls, Backstreet Boys. I've seen this question before. I don't remember it. Cool. Audience. The lifeline of your choice. Well, let's see what the kids have to say. Seventy-two percent of Backstreet Boys. That's what I thought well, the too. The kids are pretty much in agreement here. I'm gonna give you fifteen more seconds to come up with a final. The answer. final answer. That's who I thought it was from the get-go, so I wanted to be sure. Banking on the kids in our poll. Fine. Yep. I guess you could say that answer was the bomb. You're right. All right. Excellent. Now let's see if you can double your money with this next question. Going for four thousand dollars. Which of these TV characters has a watcher named Rupert Giles? Buffy Summers, Dark Angel, Fox Mulder, The Pretender. A. Buffy Summers. Final answer. You're down with answer A. Fair enough. Yep, from uh, the show Buffy the Vampire Slayer. Smooth move. You got it. You're booming along right now. But we've got eight more chances to stump you before you walk away as a kid millionaire. Eight grand. In a long-running series of Michel Michelin tire ads, what is shown inside the tires? Pillow, globe, baby, book. I need the okay, lifeline. Go ahead. Select a lifeline. Phone a friend. Knowledge of this kind of thing is as wide and flowing as the mighty Mississippi. Let's see if we can get a hold of him. Yeah. Hey Jake, Regis Philbin here. Would you mind sharing your expertise with us? All right. Well, come on now. Give me the question. Much obliged. Okay, here's the question. That's not one I know. I don't pay much attention to them. Well, this is no good. Well, most of the kids in my school probably know, but I don't watch much TV. Can you at least give us a guess? Well, shoot, my gut's telling me to say C, but I'm no expert. Sorry. Good enough. Thanks for your help. Goodbye. Yeah, all right. Bye. Jake thinks you should go with C. How's that sound to you? Um... I'm not so sure that kid was right, huh? Okay. 50-50. 50-50 it is. Computer, please pull out two of the answers, making sure one of the answers left is the correct one. There you have it. Hope it helps. I'm already a bag with some water. Okay. I'll just go with that C, baby, final answer. How's your game going? Back on board. Uh, I lose up all my lifelines on the $8,000 question, and I just took a gas. Nice going. Oh, and I got it right. But I'm out of lifeline, so it's all up to me if I want to make it to a million. Hey, that's radical. You're $8,000 richer and two questions away from the next safe haven. Let's go. Here we go for $16,000. <coughs> Which of these websites is the best place to find information about sports? Amazon.com, eBay.com, RollingStone.com, ESPN.com. I'm going ESPN. D, final answer. Answer D is the one Because Amazon.com is where you buy your Koopas. eBay is where you buy vintage stuff. You Rolling Stone is music. Right. And ESPN is sports. That was a good process of elimination. Especially with the Amazon one where you buy your Koopas. 16,000 bucks. That'll almost buy your first car. But if you really want some cool wheels, you better check out your thirty-two thousand dollar question. Here we go for thirty-two thousand. Singer Aaron Carter is the younger brother of a member of which of these popular boy bands? Ninety-eight Degrees, Backstreet Boys, In Sync, BB Mac. 
Aaron Carter is related to Nick Carter, who was a member of the Backstreet Boys, so B, final answer. You're putting your money on answer B. Yes. $32,000! Yay! So my run is over $3.6 million now. Boy, you're one sharp kid. You've hit 32000 and the second safe haven of the game. Now let's pick up the pace and take a look at your next question. Risk-free shot on this question, so if I get it wrong, I don't lose anything. Here it is for 64000 It is customary to remove your shoes before entering a house in which of these countries? Cameroon, Mexico, Denmark, Japan. It is customary to remove your shoes before entering a house in which of these countries? I'm going to take a guess on this one. I don't think it's Cameroon, and I don't think it's Denmark. I have it between Mexico or Japan. I'm going to take a guess. But even if I'm wrong, I don't lose anything. I will say... I'm 50% sure that it's Cam... It's 50% sure it's Mexico and 50% sure Japan. If I had a 50-50, I don't know if I would have left those two or something else. But I will take a guess. Customary to remove your shoes. Mexico or Japan. I'm just gonna go with Japan. For real? Is that your final answer? It's a 50-50 shot for me, so if it's not Japan, I'm thinking it's Mexico. Because I don't think it's Cameroon, totally and I don't think it's okay. Denmark. So I'll just say Japan. Yeah. Oh, and I got it! Oh my gosh! I was debating Mexico or Japan, and I got it with Japan. Your four questions from the top. You can do it. For $125,000. Now the risks are greater. Here we go. Which of these words describes the relationship between the fractions two thirds and three sec three to halves? Equivalent, reciprocal, negative, complementary. B reciprocal. Final answer. Is that your final answer? Yes. Answer B looks pretty awesome to you. Got it. Yep, I'm thinking it's reciprocal. Ooh, yep. That's right. Woo! Now we're going for $250,000. I think you got the college fund started here. That's 125000 bucks and a chance at a quarter million. But if I get this here next question go. wrong, I lose 93000 Could take the one twenty five, but if I get it right... It's 250. Here we go. Which composer of classical music was nicknamed the Waltz King? Ludwig von Beethoven, Wolfgang Amadeus Mozart, Johann Strauss Jr., Peter Tchaikovsky. I'm saying Strauss Jr. Final answer. For real? Is that your final answer? Final answer. Johann Strauss Jr. Because I know it's not Beethoven, I know it's not Mozart, and I don't believe it's Tchaikovsky. Sweet, huh? Oh, cool. Hey, you're yep. right. Woo. Two away from the million. No stopping now. You're just two away from the million. You're going to go all the way, kid. I know it. We'll see that $500,000 question when I come back. Okay, here we go. $500,000 question, two away from the million, but I have no lifeline. So here we go. Which of these characters is a villain from the holiday TV special, The Year Without a Santa Claus? Abominable Snowman, Winter Warlock, Snow Miser, Jack Frost. See Snow Miser, final answer. Yes, Snow Miser, of course. Totally your final answer? I remember when I first had this question, it was worth a quarter million dollars, and I had a, I had a huge debate, but I decided See, to take a gamble because I thought I remembered seeing it, and it turns out my gut was right. Yeah, and I just yeah. want half a million dollars! The bomb, you're right. If I can hang on to the half mil, 
my run will be over four million dollars. One million bucks riding on this next wow. one. Are you pumped? Are you psyched? You should be. This is the big time, kid. This is what you're waiting for. Let's play. <laughs> Now, I could take the $500,000 if I wanted to, but if I get it wrong, I drop all the way back down to $32,000. Oh, get it yeah. right, though? It's a million. <sighs> get it wrong? It's down to 32, but I could take the half mil if I wanted to. For $1 million. Which of these countries boycotted the 1984 Summer Olympics in Los Angeles? Soviet Union? China? Romania? Yugoslavia? I have a hunch on this one, but just so I don't lose it, I'm thinking about taking the $500,000. If I were to guess, if I were to guess, I'd say Yugoslavia, but I really, I, I really don't want to risk it, and that $500,000 will put me at $4,098,000. I am going to take the $500,000. Oh, good but choice. if I were to guess, I'd say Yugoslavia. Had enough, huh? Well, you're okay. at the top of tonight's leaderboard anyway. And the answer is? Wrong. Here's the correct answer. It was the Soviet Union. I would have been wrong. Oh, okay, good. At least hey, you made a good cool choice. Wants to be a half millionaire. Didn't you read the box? A Woo! sharp young kid like yourself should know the name of the game All right, is. Five hundred thousand dollars. Who wants to be a millionaire? Kids so my run for this game is at four million ninety-eight thousand dollars, and I'll see you all for my next video. All right, bye everybody. Letting us know what to call you. Oh, thanks. Crazy obs. Are we ready to go? Yeah. Here we go. Who wants to be a millionaire kids edition? Game 10. All right, here it is. Your very first question. First oh, question wow. is worth $100. Wow. Here we go. $100 question. What kind of food is jerky? Dried meat? Bean soup? Trail mix? Tater tots? Having eaten this kind of food before, jerky is dried meat. A. So, you're cool with answer A. Fine. Yep. Hey, you're Good right. Good old beef jerky worth $100. Okay, you waste the first one, but they're gonna get much tougher now. Let's see what's in store for you for your $200 question. Here we go. Welcome to my 10th game of Who Wants to Be a Millionaire Kids Edition for the PC, in which so far I've won myself $3,598,000 in 9 games, and I'm hoping to win another million, as this time we have Connor Mayrose joining in. Hi everyone. Hello. Let's go tackle that million. Who Wants to Be a Millionaire Kids Edition? Your presentation. 